Hey there football fans, welcome back to Soccer News Center. Today we've got some shocking news coming out of Manchester United. A group of passionate supporters is planning a protest against the potential reintegration of Mason Greenwood into the club's plans. These dedicated fans are not holding back. They're making their voices heard loud and clear outside Old Trafford before United's first home game of the season against Wolverhampton Wanderers. And they're not just bringing banners, they're bringing a powerful message, female fans demand no Greenwood return and violence against women. The organizers, who wish to remain anonymous due to fears of backlash, are calling on the club to take a stand. They want United to uphold high standards of player conduct and show that they prioritize the well-being of their fans and the community. For those of you who might not be aware, Mason Greenwood, a talented 21-year-old player, has been out of action since his arrest in January. He was charged with attempted rape, controlling and coercive behavior, and assault occasioning actual bodily harm. However, the charges were dropped in February due to the withdrawal of key witnesses and new evidence. Now, Manchester United has been conducting its own investigation into the matter, and fans are anxiously waiting for a decision on Greenwood's future at the club. But these protesters are preparing themselves for the worst, fearing that he may be given another chance. If Greenwood does stay, United has reportedly discussed a phased process for his reintegration. This includes counseling and even a televised interview where he would be questioned about the events that led to his arrest. The final decision will rest with Chief Executive Richard Arnold, based on a report from other executives. But these fans are not backing down. They're planning to gather at the Holy Trinity statue outside Old Trafford, seeking support from fellow fans who are already protesting against the Glazer family's ownership of the club. They're even launching a Twitter account to explain their opposition to Greenwood's return. While the protest is being led by female fans, they hope to receive support from fans of all genders. And so far, they've been encouraged by the unity among match-going fans who are outraged and disgusted by Greenwood's actions. This issue goes beyond football. It's about standing up against violence and demanding accountability. Nike has already dropped Greenwood as a sponsored athlete, and United sponsors have expressed their concerns to the club. But there is a divide among fans, with some believing that Greenwood should be given another chance since he hasn't been convicted of any crime. However, the protesters argue that it's not just about the legal aspect. They point out other instances where Greenwood has damaged the club's reputation, such as lockdown parties and being expelled from the England camp for breaking the rules. They see an attitude of entitlement and egotism that they can't support. So, will Manchester United listen to their passionate fans? Or will they prioritize commercialism and trophies over their own values? This is a crucial moment for the club, and the decisions they make will have a lasting impact on their relationship with the fans. Stay tuned for updates on this developing story, and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more football news. Until next time, this is Soccer News Center, signing off.